Welcome to the Clonard Chronicles Where everyone is connected Welcome to the Clonard Chronicles Fun ideas and suggestions accepted Welcome to the Welcome to the students, teachers and parents of the Clonard College community Clonard Chronicles Hey everyone, welcome to this week's episode of the Clonard Chronicles from ISO 2.0 I'm Crystal, one of the Year 11 SRCs and I'm so excited to be able to talk to you all today um, obviously we've been put back into online learning, which I know for a lot of you may be a hard thing to handle. But look, we got through it once before so we can get through it again. I'm sure of it. Just remember to look out for your friends, family, classmates, but most importantly yourself. And if you ever feel like you're struggling or need help, don't hesitate to reach out to your teachers or even the student services because they're all there to lend a helping hand, okay? We can get through this together, all right? Hey girls, it's Lucinda here, you are the Year 11 SRC. In today's episode, we have a new workout, a new recipe for you to try, as well as our house ladies giving us some exciting news. Our Year 7s are going to be explaining their new initiative, and the Year 10s are going to be showing off their baking skills. Our liturgy and identity leaders have also got a very special announcement for us. Um, we've also got the Triumph leaders with some new music recommendations, but stay tuned for Mr. Mac at the end. Hey girls, it's Ella, I'm one of your Year 11 Health and Wellbeing Leaders. This week we have another workout challenge for you, it's called Abs of Steel. It's great fun and we highly recommend you give it a go. Hi girls, I'm Abby and I'm your other Year 11 Health and Wellbeing Leader. This week's recipe is macadamia lemon snack balls. They're really quick and easy to make. Once you've finished, make sure you send a photo through. And if you make any other recipes during the week, send a photo through to your house leaders as we'd love to see them. Hey everyone, we have an exciting opportunity for you to earn some house points. As you all know, last term, Lilia won Quarantine Cup. But considering we're all back into remote learning again, you might have one more chance at winning some house points. Introducing the Quarantine Cup Redemption Round. All houses are back to zero points for this term, so now you have a second chance for your house to win. Like last time, all you have to do to earn house points is to send in a photo to your house leaders of you exercising or doing some sort of cooking or baking. That includes going for a walk, bike ride, working out, or even making brownies, dinner for your family, or a healthy recess. Make sure to send in your photos for a house point to your house leaders. Good luck everyone, and may the best house win. Hi everyone, I'm Emily. Hi there! That was Hunter. We are the SRC Year 7, and we've been working alongside the wellbeing teachers to organise a fun and exciting event. This event is called the Olympics. It will take place during the online learning period. Each week, there will be a challenge for the girls to participate in. Classes have chosen or designed a mascot based on their house colour, and this mascot will represent them through the whole Olympics. Here are some of the mascots. Last week's challenge was a trick shot, where the girls sent in a video of them mastering a challenge. There was a tie for first place, seven red and seven purple. This week's challenge is the most creative cake or cupcakes. It could be something like this. After the closing date, the wellbeing classes will choose one entry from their class that they think has the potential to win. Which will go in the running against the other entries from the other classrooms. Emily and I will choose gold, silver, bronze and each of those will gain an amount of points for their house. At the end, the classroom with the most points wins the Olympics. Good luck you sevens. Hi, I'm Ainsley, one of the college mentors and today I'd like to talk about the Endangered Species Bake Off. To bring the Clonard community together during this really tough time, we thought it'd be a great idea to get involved with the Endangered Species Bake Off. We would like if you, students, parents, teachers, even your dog were to enter the competition. The Bake Off's message is to bring attention and awareness to endangered species in our area and aim to help them. More information about the Bake Off can be found in the attached flyer. Good luck and happy baking. I can't wait to see what you guys make. Hey girls, to mark the extraordinary year that we've had, the Legion Identity team have decided to create a piece of artwork that will be put up on display to help us recognise the unusual time that we've had 
as a college community. We are creating a mosaic of pictures of all the families at Clonard to resemble a symbol of this year and we need your help. By now, your welcome should have set up a folder in your year level teams for you to put up a picture of you and your family. All you have to do is upload a picture of you and your family with your surname, the name of the picture, as soon as you can so we can get to work on creating our design. Thank you so much for your help. Some songs that the Triumph team are loving at the moment are Number one, Put Your Records On by Caroline Bailey Ray. Number two, Soul Sister by Train. Number three, Watermelon Sugar by Harry Styles. Okay, my song recommendations are Number four, we've got I'm Still Standing by Elton John. We've got number five is um, Build Me Up Buttercup by The Foundations. Number six is We Are Family by Sledge Sisters. Number seven is Good As Hell by Lizzo and Ariana. Number eight is Unwritten by Natasha Benningfield. And number nine is Can't Hold Us by Macklemore and Ryan Lewis. And number 10 is our favourite, Survivors by Destiny Child. Hey girls, Mr Mac here. Every Tuesday in wellbeing time from 12.05 to 12.30, um, I'm reading The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn. Um, we've had a couple of sessions so far. You're all welcome. We're up to a really great part in the story where um, Huck's dad, known as Pat, Pat Finn, has just turned up for the first time and Huck doesn't like it one little bit. Uh, so if you want to join in, uh, all you need to do is send me a message uh, in Teams or an email and I'll just add you to the group that's already there. Um, come and join. It's a great story. We are people of commitment. We will stand beside a friend seeking justice and a better world. God's peace on all descent.